today I'm going to be reading I Am Every Good Thing by Derek Barnes and Gordon C. James. I am a nonstop ball of energy, powerful and full of light. I am a go-getter, a difference maker, a leader. I am every good thing that makes the world go round, you know, like gravity or the glow of moonbeams over a field of brand new snow. I am good to the core, like the center of a cinnamon roll. Yeah, that good. I am skateboard tricks, scraped knees, and elbows. Looks like he fell off because he's riding his skateboard. But you know what? I am right back on my feet again. He didn't give up. I am one eye open, one eye closed, peeking through a microscope, gazing through a telescope, checking out the spaces around me and plotting out those far off places I have yet to go, but will. I wonder if he wants to be an astronaut or a research scientist. I am a gentleman and a scholar. I am kind and polite like, yes ma'am and yes sir, helping my grandmother cross the street and saying bless you when a stranger has to sneeze. That's what a gentleman does, all those things. And a scholar is somebody who learns. I am a cool breeze, a perfect paper airplane that glides for blocks for miles forever. I am a whirring flame of creativity I am a lightning round of questions. That means they ask questions really fast. And a star-filled sky of solutions. I am an explorer planting a flag on every square foot of this planet where I belong. I am a sponge soaking up information, knowledge, and wisdom. I want it all and I am all ears. That means he's listening and learning to everything. I am Saturday mornings in the summertime. I am two bounces and a front flip off the diving board. Ooh, that's hard. I am hilarious. That means he's funny. I am the life of the party. I am that smile forming on your face right now. That looks like so much fun, doesn't it? I am the boom bap, boom, boom bap, when the bass line thumps and the kick drum jumps. I'm the perfect beat, the perfect rhyme, keeping everything on point and always on time. But you already knew that. So he's talking about being a drummer, like we are when we use our blue sticks. I am a grand slam, bases fully loaded. That's in baseball. I am a nasty two-handed dunk holding on to the rim. Look, his dad's lifting him up to make a, a dunk. Just to remind you that I'm still the man, believe that. I am the undisputed champion. I am a highlight reel of magnificence. That means like when you watch sports, a lot of times they'll show you what happened or the highlights, the good things from the game. So he's the good things. I am the celebration, the applause, applause are when people clap, and the standing ovation. A standing ovation is when people stand for you at the end of something and they clap for you. I am victory. I am a brother, a son, a nephew, a favorite cousin, a grandson. I am a friend. I am real. Oh, look, it's a looks like brother and sister, doesn't it? And they're hugging. And maybe a father and son hugging. I am tight hugs, a hand to hold, a shoulder to cry on, if you have to. I hope you never have to. I am here. Although I am something like a superhero, every now and then, 
I am afraid. I am not what they might call me, and I will not answer to any name that is not my own. I am what I say I am. I am that sound in the forest when the mighty tree falls. I bet that's a big sound. I am waves crashing gently on the shore. I am a force of nature, a miracle, a blessing. Every person is a miracle. I am brave. I am hope. I am my ancestors' wildest dreams. I am worthy of success, of respect, of safety, of kindness, of happiness. Look, there's President Barack Obama. And without a shadow of a doubt, I am worthy to be loved. I am worthy to be loved. And this tells us a little bit uh, about the author. The author, his name is Derek Barnes. And he wrote this book. And he's received a lot of awards for writing. He lives in North Carolina with his wife and they have four sons. And the illustrator has also received many awards for his illustrations. I mean, look how beautiful these pictures are. And he also lives in North Carolina with his wife, and he has two children. The end. I really hope you like this book. I loved it. I thought it was um, kind of poetic and the way it talks about how a person is every good thing. And I loved the pictures in this book. They're just so vibrant and just, I wish I could share this with you in person, but I just love these pictures. Have a great day.